Welcome to a presentation about diabetes brought to you by your neighborhood doctors. Please remember that we will cover the topic in general terms. Please consult your doctors for specific questions pertaining to you. Diabetes is like a car that has run out of gas. The car needs fuel to run, just like your body needs insulin to function properly. Without enough insulin, your body can't use the sugar in your blood for energy. This causes the sugar to build up in your blood, leading to high blood sugar levels. Just like a car without gas can't move, your body can't use the sugar it needs for energy when you have diabetes. Diabetes is a condition that affects the way your body processes sugar. It can cause a range of symptoms, including increased thirst and frequent urination. People with diabetes often feel thirsty and need to urinate more often than usual. Fatigue. Diabetes can make you feel tired and weak. Blurred vision. High blood sugar levels can cause changes in your vision. Slow healing of cuts and bruises. Diabetes can slow down the healing process of wounds. Weight loss. Even though you may be eating more, diabetes can cause you to lose weight due to the body not being able to process sugar properly. Numbness or tingling in hands or feet. High blood sugar levels can damage nerves in your body, leading to numbness or tingling in your hands or feet. Diabetes is a condition that affects people of all ages, genders, and backgrounds. It is estimated that over 30 million people in the United States have diabetes, and it is one of the leading causes of death in the country. The prevalence of diabetes varies by age, gender, and race slash ethnicity. In general, adults aged 4 to 5 years or older are more likely to have diabetes than younger adults. Additionally, men are more likely to have diabetes than women. Finally, certain racial slash ethnic groups are more likely to have diabetes than others. For example, African Americans, Hispanics slash Latinos, American Indians slash Alaska Natives, and some Asian Americans slash Pacific Islanders are at higher risk for developing diabetes than other racial slash ethnic groups. It is important to note that while these demographic trends exist for diabetes prevalence in the United States, anyone can develop this condition regardless of their age, gender, or race slash ethnicity. Diabetes is a condition in which the body does not produce enough insulin or the body cannot use the insulin it produces effectively. Insulin is a hormone that helps the body use glucose, sugar, from food for energy. The exact cause of diabetes is unknown but it is believed to be caused by a combination of genetic and environmental factors. Genetics plays a role in how the body processes sugar and certain genes may make people more likely to develop diabetes. Environmental factors such as diet, physical activity, and weight can also increase the risk of developing diabetes. Treatment for diabetes is focused on managing blood sugar levels and preventing complications. The main treatments are lifestyle changes, such as eating a healthy diet, exercising regularly, and maintaining a healthy weight. Medications may also be prescribed to help control blood sugar levels. These medications can include insulin injections, oral medications, or other injectable medications. In some cases, surgery may be recommended to help control blood sugar levels. Additionally, regular checkups with your doctor are important to monitor your condition and prevent any complications from developing. The prognosis of diabetes depends on how well the condition is managed. If diabetes is not managed properly, it can lead to serious health complications such as heart disease, stroke, kidney failure, and nerve damage. However, with proper management and lifestyle changes, people with diabetes can live long and healthy lives. It is important to work closely with your healthcare team to ensure that your blood sugar levels are kept in a healthy range. This includes eating a balanced diet, exercising regularly, taking medications as prescribed, and monitoring your blood sugar levels regularly. With proper management and lifestyle changes, people with diabetes can lead full and active lives. Thank you for listening to this presentation brought to you by Talking Raymond. For information, check us out retinali.com info. Be safe. Love you.